Oh crap, you're already right there. I didn't notice that. You over here. No, uh, your mom? No, my dad. Oh, sick. Bye. Is Landon's here? First time ever at my grandma's house? Yep. Hi, vlog. You feel like, I feel short right now. Why? Dude, I'm like aiming the camera. Oh, guys, you can't <laughs> tell, but I'm aiming the camera like, like this. <laughs> I have to go like this whenever I'm filming Landon, because like that's like the eye level of Landon. Yeah. But this is the crib. So nothing super interesting, but uh. Well, what about the dirt bike? It's in the garage. All right, guys. So, well, there's the, there's the bike. Okay. Landon has not seen the dirt bike yet, so I want to get his reaction. I'm not expecting super, like a super big reaction or anything, but. Yeah, it's like something he's never seen before, so I'm just gonna go ahead and do this really. Yo, heck a different person. It's huge. Yeah? Did you jump it? Did I jump it? Like, yeah. ramps? Yeah. I told you he wouldn't give me much of a reaction because it's just a dirt bike. It's not like I'm surprising him with an Audi R8 or anything. <laughs> it's good lighting too. Oh my gosh. I was about to intro it. I can't breathe now because like this. You know how you guys are oh, you're eating hot Cheetos and then like it just starts burning all of a sudden in your throat because that like the. Alright, what's up guys? So we're back in today. I hope you guys are all having a fantastic day. It's actually not daytime for us, it's nighttime, but wherever you're at, it might be daytime, I don't know, probably like Australia or something. Is it daytime in Australia right now? Either? Yeah. It actually is? Probably some parts, yeah. So basically, we're just going to both be talking about our experiences with online school. He actually, I'll let him talk in a minute, but he just started online school, and uh, how's it going so far? Do you like it? No. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> yeah, um, actually, it's pretty like it's pretty simple to get used to. Like at like at first, because I've done this program before, um, at a different school. But at first, um, the setup was a little bit different because I guess they updated it. But now I'm really used to it, and now I really like it. And time goes by like fast, so like you get your stuff done like as long as you're working and stuff. But personally, I like to work with music on like. Mm -hmm. Same. We have little, like, uh, videos going through, like, maybe, they can go up to, like, what, 10 minutes? Yeah. Some of them. I think one of them was maybe, like, maybe 12 minutes. Um, yeah, so you gotta watch that, and then, like, when we're doing, like, whenever I'm doing a quiz or a test, I'll just, like, put on some music or something, and, then, like, yeah. It's pretty easy, though, like, yeah. to get used to. And the reason why I'm filming this video, a lot of people are, like, oh, you have it all easy now because you do online school, and it's like, you don't have to do this and that and that. No. You're, and you're, you're like, you're almost, you're pretty close to being right. School is way easier now. But in my point of view, I know, like, maybe 65% of school kids like to just, like, get school done with. They don't really have much of an interest. But that rest of the percent likes the school and likes getting, like, involved in things. But for people that don't really, like, they, they couldn't, they could care less about getting involved in stuff and just, like, all of that kind of stuff. I would say that online school is a lot better for you. Why would you, if you don't even like school to begin with, why would you want to make it hard for you, like, to do? I just think, like, if you want to, like, get done with school fast, then you should look towards online school. And yeah. if you want it to be easy, if you think school's hard, I would highly recommend Clovis online if you're in the area, obviously. If you're, like, in France watching this video, then you have to look to something else. But I'm just saying, like, Online school, for me, I've been doing it all of, I think I, I started, when did I start? I started a semester into freshman year, and I was like, I'm done, the I cannot do this. Semester. Yeah, I started the sem like, yeah, I started the second semester and finished all of freshman year, and now I'm a sophomore and I'm still doing online school. It stuck with me the whole time. I really like it. I think a lot of people are like, oh yeah, I'm just going to do it for this amount of time, not singling out landing, because that's what he's saying. But I feel like a lot, pe a lot of people are saying like I'm just gonna do it for the semester, get my credits up, and then go back. And I'm not gonna like, I don't even like online school or anything like that. I just want to get my credits easy and then go back into regular school. Like that's fine and stuff. But I feel like people will just like learn to like online school and then they're just gonna stick with it and then just keep going and going. That's what I'm gonna do. I've learned to like online school. I liked it from the beginning. At first, I was just like bugged because I just wanted to not 
have to go and see a teacher. That was like one yeah. of the things for me, like in school, the teachers would put me in such a bad mood. If they're like extremely happy, I will get so mad because like why? Are, like I don't like school at all. Why are you happy to see thirty something grumpy kids? Like I don't know if you guys are the same way, but I I didn't like I don't like school. I'm still in school, so I don't like school at all. I don't have any interest in it. I don't like you know anything like that. I don't. I didn't really ever get involved with the school. I was never even allowed to because my grades were so bad. What? <laughs> My grades were just so bad that I wasn't even able to do anything in the school. So that just put me in a bad mood. And I was like, well, what the heck am I supposed to do if I can't learn the way that you want me to learn? And there was literally no other way to learn because, like, you can go and get help with, like, your counselor or whatever, like, if you're in middle school and high school. But, like, for sixth grade and stuff, you don't have that stuff. You don't have that other resource except, like, a tutor or something, and that barely ever helps, like... They, they'll never understand what you're going through, but like online school, they completely understand why you're there and everything. So they make it like 10 times easier. That, okay, sorry, sorry. Like, what they also help you out with, like I just took this test today actually. You go in and uh, you take a, like a pre, like a pre-test to see where you're at. And then like, so like I got a 27% on the test, which is actually good because it took out 50 assignments and eight quizzes and one project of that <clears throat> class yeah and um i was just scanning through it so i wasn't like making it a big deal because she said it wasn't towards my grade or anything but then I, when i realized at the end i kind of regretted just like going through it. i could have spent way more time on it <clears throat> but like i like the fact that you get to do that and like there's some downfalls about it most definitely too like you have to be on at like 12 o'clock uh, p.m and like Knowing, if you know me, I sleep in a lot, he like does, a yeah. lot, and I'm a heavy sleeper too, so I'm hard to wake up, so yeah, it's kind of like the downfall, but I like the fact that you get to go in and like meet your teacher and like, and like you have someone to email to help you out or whatever. Mm -hmm. so there's plenty more I could keep going, but mm -hmm. back to what you were saying. Oh, I kind of like, I grew into the fact that like, okay, I have to go see my teacher, but then I started looking at it as a, I started looking at it as like a really good thing, and it, it really is a good thing. Your teachers are actually really there to help you and especially this one teacher like I finally found a teacher that completely understands and like is able to actually get on my personal level of like knowledge and things it's really like nice to me Mr. Rio Frio if you're watching this thank you so much for everything you've done for me uh, you're probably stuck with me for the rest of high school so um, yeah I really like online school um, Landon has his um, I was gonna call it an iPad Landon has his laptop here. here. We're gonna go ahead and show you guys um, what the actual school looks like, um, because I feel like a lot of people are like wondering, like that do a public school, like what does that actually look like, like, you know what I mean? Here, basically, just the simple login. I don't know if you guys can really see that. The simple login, right there. Blur the, blur the. Uh, yeah, I will. And so basically, you press the login, and, log and then this is basically like the setup of showing all your classes don't mind the percentages i'm working on those most definitely. that's the grades percentages obviously the grades you guys know that but all of those right there all these boxes that's all your classes he has seven or six seven he has seven classes to do so that's like the average amount so basically this is like this is the video right here that you have to watch hold on so basically you have like a person up in the corner and then like all that and then you go through here and there's a bunch of assignments or more videos or anything like that. Um, and then you go back here. Hold on. Home button. That'll and take then you, you can straight click back like, to normal classes. You click right here and then it'll show you what you have to do. Like, Basically this is through the whole year. If you're like on your grades or something, like if you're like... Excuse me. If you're like um, on time and all that, the, the uh, staff at the program there at the uh, office they allow you to like make your own days that you get to work and stuff if you're like if you're doing good and accelerating fast so I like that too this is basically like if you obviously live in the area so like okay if you don't live in Fresno Clovis area then you can just skip past this part you just go to this website basically and then you can go enrollment enroll 
The link will be in the description you for put the website. In, you put in all, all your information, like, right here, obviously. But, yeah. That's basically it. That really is all there is to it, guys. But, um... And another really cool thing that I like about online school so much is that you literally don't have to worry about anyone else except yourself. You don't have to worry about like drama at school or any of that stuff that doesn't even like involve school. But it's literally just you and your laptop and the person talking to you through the screen. It's super easy and it's just like there's no distractions unless you distract yourself. Other than that, online school is so easy and you can get your work done so fast. I think you can actually finish high school six months earlier than the average person that does public school. So that's and, like insane. But you do need responsibility most definitely. And you like need, you, yeah, and you definitely, definitely you, do. Yeah, you need to be like on your stuff. Like if you're just like, they'll kick you out if you're not on. If you're not but, actually. Hey, <laughs> hey what, go, go. Okay, but like if you're not on for a certain amount of time, they'll kick you out and then like, I forgot what I was saying. Honestly. If you're not on by 12 o'clock and you miss a certain amount of days and you're not like consistent and obedient to the time that you have to be on, they'll actually, I think they warn you before your teacher like will physically tell you in person like, hey, you need to like start getting on early. And if you don't, they will literally unroll you. It's so easy for them to do that and it's so fast. You know, it's really easy if you're just responsible, do your work and stay on track and it's just like school fly by and it'll feel like it like it it'll feel like it flew by in two years less. Like it's so fast, so easy and I can't stress enough that you should really do it. It's like your education matters more than anything else. So. Well like what well if like like you said, like if they do wanna go into the NFL, NBA all that stuff like then you got to stay in school obviously and like because that's what they want but like if you're just doing that for the um like the fun of it then like you could do online school and then you can go to like a i don't know what is that called you can just go online school and then you can go and play for a random team you know obviously it's up to you guys i would make the switch um landon did because he needs to get his credits up and stuff. I'm not going to go into any of that because that's his personal business. We don't know if he's going to stay. I'll keep you guys updated, I guess, um, on Landon's situation with online school. But I'm here to stay. I'm doing online school for the rest of my years. I love it, and I cannot wait to just be done with school and get to just film daily videos for you guys. I'm going to try to stay as consistent as I can on YouTube. Um, I've been trying this, like these past videos but um that's basically it if you guys want to know anything else about online school um definitely comment below i'll for sure 100 percent get back to you as soon as you comment because i'm always on my ipad doing something stupid i don't even know or editing a video or something like that but if you guys did enjoy this video don't forget to smash the like button if that's something that you want to do that's it for me and landon today um that's all i gotta say peace out peace out i just realized that what i said just now rhymed so Dab.